One thing I knew, though, as Americans, we were always supposed to open our arms and open our hearts, not turn our backs. And that's what Medicaid did. Yeah, I'm a row house Philadelphia guy from Olney, a city of brotherly love and sisterly affection. I joined the Marine Corps right after the uh, Iranian hostage crisis. My Marine Corps service is nothing compared to the battles this kid's been in. That at her time of birth, the only sign of life she had was a slightly beaten heart. It took them five minutes just to resuscitate her to breath. At four and a half months old, she had open heart surgery to repair three holes in her heart. Nothing prepares you in life when you have a 17-month-old with Down syndrome and a three-month-old that your wife calls you and tells you she's just been diagnosed with breast cancer. When I got married, I didn't expect a child with a disability. I didn't expect open heart surgeries. I didn't expect a wife with breast cancer. I didn't expect to be diagnosed with Parkinson's. But you know what? It happens. You can have a lot of money, but unfortunately, the cost of medical care is real. I often compare Medicaid to like natural disasters. Like when you see a natural disaster in Oklahoma, a tornado hit, and you see people's houses wiped off the face of the earth, you say, we have to help them. As Americans, that's what we do best. We help each other. Not everybody takes care of the sick, the needy, the disabled, the elderly, the poor. Medicaid does. Medicaid is truly freedom.